Chismis Trends is your source of daily news and trivia about your favorite celebrity. Mukhang imposible nang magkabalikan o gumawa ng teleserye ang ex-couple at dating magka-love team na sina James Reed at Nadine Lustre. Ito'y kahit pa nakatakda nang bumalik ang actor-singer at record producer sa Pilipinas sa susunod na buwan para sa ilang projects na gagawin niya rito. Ayon kay James, walang katotohanan ang mga balitang tuluyan na niyang iiwan ang Pilipinas para sa kanyang international music career. Sa panayam ng CNN Philippines sa binata na kasalukuyang nasa Los Angeles, California para sa ilang international projects, babalik na siya sa bansa sa darating na April. As soon as I landed here, people were saying that I'd move here for good but that's really not the case. I'm only here until April and I'll be heading home again. But I came out here to work on music meet a lot of people try and see what doors will open, make a name for myself out here, and make the Filipinos proud, kwento ng ex-boyfriend ni Nadine. Isa sa mga pinagkaabalahan ng aktor sa US ay ang bago niyang single and carry release lamang, ang Hello 2.0 Legends Only, kung saan nakakolaborate niya si JB ng GOT7 at ang Taiwanese rapper na si OZI. Ang nasabing track ay remix ng dalawang libot dalawang putisang single niyang Hello, I'm really glad that I was able to get JB from GOT7 and OZI, he's from Taiwan, to jump on the track. I would like to thank my management here in LA, Transparent Arts, also known as the Far East Movement, the first Asian artist to have a number one record in America. It's really great to create a track with different Asian acts supporting each other, pagbabahagi pa ni James. Kwento pa ni James na buo nila ni na JB at OZI ang Hello 2.0 via online, we were in three different countries, so, everything we did was online. It was really easy working with them. Hello is a really fun track and I sent the track to them and let them do their thing and when they sent back the vocals I was like we have to release this you know and they did an amazing job interpreting the song Say Pa ng Binata. At sa tanong kung posible bang makagawa uli siya ng serye o pelikula ngayong 2022, definitely for this year, I am working on a lot of music. I'm very excited to release new songs. But yeah for this year, I'm focusing on music and I'm also excited to get back home. I will be signing co-artists to Careless Music, my music label and will be releasing a lot of music and that's also what I'm excited for, Ania pa. Matatanda ang nagpaliwanag si James sa panayam ng The Ones via podcast tungkol sa pamamahinga niya sa paggawa ng movies at teleserye, I Love Acting. But sometimes after doing teleserye after teleserye, it gets repetitive and I felt like kind of robotic. I craved something that came from me that I can really express. I was just following instructions. It wasn't feeding my soul. It was difficult for me to step away from all of that because I was in a very good place. But I stepped away from doing that and I chose something more difficult which is something that I still had to grow in such as making music and production, writing songs, paliwanag ni James.